Hi everybody, it's Wednesday, so we are three days into Real Nappy Week, and today's video is going to be all about in our cloth nappy favourites. So we have a bunch of categories and questions, and I'm just going to go through and answer them all, and show you which nappies I like best. It's really hard to tell you which style of nappy I like best, because they're all so good for different things. But I have to say that I'm really stuck between All in One or All in Two to be my top favourites. I have a few brands which I like best and they take up the majority of my stash. I have loads of Bongenius Organics. Um, these are a true All in One in that everything's sewn into each other. So you've got the waterproof shell and the inside and it's just all attached. I like All in Ones because they're just so convenient and easy to use. They're about as close as you'll get to disposable if you're using cotton nappies. Um, they're also really trim, so they fit into clothes well. And there's no inserts to stuff into anything. You can't get them mixed up. Like it's, just, it's just all there. It's easy. Um, the only problem I find with the Bum Genius in particular is that because it's organic cotton, it takes forever to dry. Um, not too much of a problem if you have a dryer, which we do, thankfully, but um, I think it would be a bit difficult if you didn't. That's why I like the Bum Genius V3 Easy Fix. We did like the V2s, but the V3s are so much better. We had a few leaks with the um, version 2, which is made of bamboo. Um, however, the V3s have uh, minky fabric inside, which I was convinced would not be as good as the bamboo. However, we've never had a leak and it holds so much weight. I don't know how, it just holds everything. Um, I like these all-in-ones because the core folds out. So it literally comes out of the washing machine almost dry. It doesn't take very long to dry at all. And they are so, so trim. Like, there's nothing there. You can't say you're going to get a big cloth bum with these. <laughs> so my two favourite all-in-twos are the Itty Bitty Dinesh Snap-In one and the Close Parent Pop-In. Um, I really prefer the bamboo to the minky for the pocket. The reason I like all in twos is that you don't need as many shells as you do inserts and you can simply replace the inserts if it's just wet. So you're going to have a lot less washing to do than you would if you were just using all in ones. This is also really good if you've matched nappies up to your outfits because if you've only got one pink uh, itty bitty for example but you've got lots of inserts you won't have to change the pink shell unless it fits. I'm really struggling to decide my favourite brand. Um, I think I could probably just say all the brands I have, but um, if I really have to narrow it down, it's going to be Itty Bitty, Tot Spots, and probably Rumperoos. Um, I like Rumperoos because nothing ever escapes these nappies, even that runny breastfed food we all know and love. <laughs> Although saying that, I have recently discovered Customs, and um, I really like Preston Pants. This one is my latest edition and it's just absolutely gorgeous. Uh, and then I also like Wee Notions because they're really easy to get on with. They email you back straight away and you can literally make any nappy that you want, however you want it, and you don't get anything cuter than that. As far as favourite colours go, I like anything that's really, really bright. I like really vivid colours. Um, itty Bitty are especially good for gorgeous colours. Um, I just have, I think, every colour that they do. Um, I do prefer prints, but out of the colours, Itty Bitty always have my favourites. Um, Bum Genius have released a few favourite colours at the moment. This is Dazzle. I also like Mirror. This is their Mirror print. Um, I definitely prefer bright colours over pastels. Favourite prints could take a while. I love my prints and I have a lot. I think the best brand out there for really, really fun, funky prints is definitely Issy Bear. Um, I have a few of them, actually, I have three at the moment. Um, I have Doodle Cat, which I love. I have Watermelon, which Andy hates, but I think is gorgeous. And I also have the Little Ladybirds, which I really like as well. I then have my two new poppins. I have the turtles and the owls. Um, these are actually nappies that I bought during Real Nappy Week, um, but I really like those. Then there's my Rumpa Roos. I have the Lux Prince and the Eco Owls. I like this one because it says, ooh, most of the planet. 
I adore my lovely Spawn Genius, but my all time favourite prints are the Itty Bitty prints. I only have this one at the moment, all my others are in the wash, and I have some on the way in the post. So I'm just going to go ahead and put a picture of my favourite prints. So now I've answered all the main questions, I'm just going to go through uh, so a few little bits and bobs. My favourite closure is definitely snaps or poppers. Just because when your babies get a little older and they start to fiddle around, snaps are a lot harder to undo than velcro is. I also find that velcro can wear over time, whereas poppers don't. What's my favourite type of nappy, as in one size or size? I definitely prefer one size or birth to potty. Just because they're more cost effective, you don't have to size up once your baby grows out of the size they're already in. Favourite nappy in my whole stash? Ooh, that's a toughie. This changes from time to time, but at the moment, my favourite nappy is the Tots Bots 3. I love it. Especially our chicken licking print, which is amazing. Favourite laundry detergent is going to be Rocking Green. It's the only detergent we use to wash our cloth nappies and it's brilliant. We never have any build up issues and we have really, really hard water. There's never any ammonia smells, there's nothing, it's just great. There's never any it gets everything out, all the stains, all the smells, everything. Favourite nappy cream. We don't use a nappy cream that's cloth nappy safe. Um, if we use our nappy cream we always make sure we use a liner to protect our nappies. But my favourite is um, Organic Baby's Nappy Cream Baby Balm. And it's great. It clears up any kind of rash that she ever gets, which is very rare um, within a couple of days. Favourite cloth wipes. We only have Cheeky Wipes and Thirsties Duo Wipes. The Thirsties we use as um, wash wipes, the so face wipes for in the morning. And the Cheeky Wipes we use to clean up bums um, during the nappy change. So... The first is, is really, really soft, so I have to say they're my favourite out of the two. Favourite fabric for cloth nappies is going to have to be organic cotton, simply because it's the most absorbent. Favourite wipe solution. We only have the one new sheepish grins, and it's really good. I like the smell. Although I'm really tempted to try the CJ's Button Carcass Cleaner, because I've heard really good things about that, and I love their body lotion. Favourite storage items, um, we don't use an upper pail, we use a um, hanging wet bag and I use a Leslie's Boutique hanging wet bag and it holds up to about 30 nappies and it's great, I, you can't beat it, I love it. Favourite place to purchase, um, I'm going to have to say Funky Monkey Pants or the um, Clean Green Nappy. I like the clean green nappy because they usually have um, some kind of offer on like 20% off usually, which is great. Um, although I like Funky Monkey Pants because Emma, the lady that owns it, is really, really helpful and she sells a lot of nappies in the UK that you can't find anywhere else. My favourite thing about cloth nappies, that's a hard one, I like everything. Um, I think the main thing has got to be just the way they look and the way they're so soft. I would. If I was in nappies, I would much rather be putting a cloth nappy than a disposable. So it's just because they're so soft and they come in lots of different colours and lots of different prints. And I think it just makes the whole nappy changing experience a little better for both you and baby. So, right, so that's everything. Um, so I'll see you tomorrow for the fourth day of Real Nappy Week. Bye bye.